Go ahead, bro. What's up, y'all? It's DJ J Mob representing Orlando. I am a hip hop producer. I am one of the best producers out here in Orlando. I'm not bragging or anything like that. I represent DJing, Four Elements of Hip Hop, Graffiti, B-Boy. I got a little joint right here with my man Diamond D coming up this Saturday. You know what I'm saying? Lazy oh, Diamond D. D. Yeah, Lazy Day's coming down. Oh, I'm saying snap. Diamond D's representing, you know what I'm saying, DITC. I have websites. You can Digging hit me up. in the crates. Yeah, yeah, sir. You can hit me up on SoundClick, excuse me, soundcloud.com forward slash jmob. My Twitter is at RGN321. My DJ name is DJJ Mob, and I'm also on Facebook at DJJ Mob. I also represent Grind Season Entertainment, my man DJ Buck. Also, I will be having my own show on skliveradio.com. It's on 10 to 12. It's called Class and Session, sponsored by DJ Instincts. Peace. How long you been doing this? How long you been about producing, 20, about, bro? About 10 years. About 10 years. You lived in Orlando all your life, or where you originally New York. from? Mostly New, New York. Yeah, more, yeah, I'm saying, yeah. What got you into producing? Man, this love of hip hop, dog. You know what I'm saying? Love hip hop, love the old school parties, just the culture, man. Just it's you embrace the culture. You love hip hop. That's what it's all about. You know and what's what one thing you regret that hip hop doesn't have anymore? I think the history, man. I think the era, the gold era of the '90s was classic hip hop, '85 mm -hmm. to '95, and right. then hip hop changed. It got to the you know conglomerate, got rich. So I think we need to go back to the roots where we get our culture back. You know, the real hip hop, not this this crap that's out there. You know what I'm saying? It's hip hop, not hip hop. Name some uh, artists you work with? I work with TJ, I work with a couple of cats out here in Orlando, I uh, work with um, SB Anomaly, um, uh, E-Turn, mm -hmm. uh, just a couple of cats. Um, we go back in the old school, I did a joint with Cool Keith. Uh, my man he used to run the Sunday Magazine. He did some uh, remixes on some stuff we did back in the day, so kind of, you know, do some things. I got a cat I'm working with, this cat named Lyrical Knowledge. Right. This cat in Port Portland, Oregon I'm working with. Actually, it's uh, he's over in Oregon, his name is Aerosol. Right. Him. So I just got a couple of things going on right now, you know what I'm saying, besides the radio shows. Okay, and if cats want to reach out to you, what's the best website to check you they out? You can hit me up on my Twitter, which is at RGN321. Hit me up on Facebook, DJJ Mom, and you can hit me up my my email is RGN321 at yahoo.com. How you get that name, DJJ Mom, bro? Well, J Mom <laughs> means J because my uh -huh. first name is, you know, J. Right. And Mob is Master Breakbeats. Oh, I always okay. consider myself to be prominent in breakbeats as far as digging for records. I use the old classic EMU SP1200 that was noticed by Pete Rock back in the days. Right. So I'm kind of like an old cat, you know what I'm saying? But my whole thing is I bring out the breakbeats. That's, you know, that's how it is. You know Yo, I mean? well, Wicked 407 appreciates the interview, bro. No doubt, I hope, no doubt. hope everything goes well in the near future no for you with all your me, projects. You, you and I are going to have to connect. For you know sure, what I'm for sure. <laughs> you know what I mean? And then tell me one thing before we go. What's the, what's the most craziest thing or what's the most... Uh, Greatest thing you ever uh, found in Orlando since you've found been here? Orlando, I, I found probably um, the, the hip hop culture here. You right. Know what I'm saying, as opposed, as opposed to all these cats that are trying to make it in today's society. There's like a small little hip hop crowd here, right. but it's real strong and nothing's going to break them down. I'm here to support that. Well, we over here in Austin's Coffee Shop in Winter Park. Check this man out. You all can right. definitely check it on his website. And we appreciate the interview. No One doubt. love, bro. Peace. Respect.